This morning, 63 World War II veterans received a hero's welcome at DFW Airport when they flew to Hawaii to commemorate the 80th anniversary of the Pearl Harbor attacks. Kennedy Walker is at DFW Airport this morning. The details, Kennedy, sound like they got quite the patriotic send off. Hey, Madison, good morning. They definitely did. That plane took off right before 10 a.m., and you should have seen it. They were greeted with American flags and music, and all around, Madison, like how you mentioned, just an amazing send off. Now, there were 63 veterans that went on this trip. They were between the ages of 93 to 103. 12 of them are over 100 years old. Out of the 63, six of them were there during the Pearl Harbor attack in 1941. American Airlines donated the aircraft the veterans are flying on, and all week long up until the anniversary, which is December 7th, those veterans will be honored. Last night, they were honored with a big departure dinner in Irving. Our Doug Dunbar emceed the event and had the chance to speak with some veterans about that harrowing day. I remember it all. Got up and had a normal breakfast. We heard a screaming aircraft and moments later, a terrible explosion. American airline officials say that it is so special. It was so special just to see how happy those veterans were. And Madison, actually, what happened was the four other veterans were supposed to go on this trip when they were planning it, but they unfortunately passed away. So those American airline officials said that they were happy that these veterans got to celebrate and go on that trip. Back to you. Yeah, precious moments for sure and moments that they and the world will for certain remember.